up, man? And welcome back to the channel once again. And it's your boy, Watts Arrangements. And we back with another one. So, y'all already know, it's Mardi Gras time. So, we got to get to it. So, today, we got Edna Carr versus George Washington Carver. Mmm. Two heavy hitters. Two heavy hitters. So, look. I ain't even finna hold y'all. Man, look. Let's go ahead and slide on through. All right, y'all. Let's give a major shout out to my guy, Killer Kev, for the dope footage. Yes, sir. That back in the field, my guy. I like that. Let's get to it. This is Killer Kev production. You better get on it, man. Hey, they sound really good. That's a clean. They sound really good. Yo, that was clean. That was nice. In the pocket. Alright, alright, Carver, what y'all got? Hey, this is really good. Hey, both of them sounding real good right now, man. You can tell they put in the work in their programs. Ooh. Okay, trumpets and mellows. Come on through then.
Hey, shout out to Carver. Goodness. Okay. All right, Carver. Hey. All right, Carver. What y'all finna come through with? Okay. Okay, I know right there, beat songs are kind of focused on being loud instead of the articulation point because you can hear the raspiness. This song, just don't focus on the loudness, uh, kids. Focus on the perfection of the note. Don't focus on the loudness. Focus on the articulation. That's what you need to focus on. And I guarantee you, this song gonna be so smooth and full. All right, Carver, what y'all get? Too, but y'all doing a little huffing. Clean it up. Mm, okay. Okay, trombone. Hello. The only thing is, it's they tubas, but that can be fixed. It can be fixed. It's a small amount of details. Okay, tubas, where to play that wrong? 
Dumb! Yeah, Job. Oh my goodness, yes sir. Yeah, buddy. Alright, come on, carving that cotton. They just threw some out there. But I ain't gonna lie, Carver have been having some good rebuttals to what Carl been doing. So we'll see what they got next. Change out a battery. Love the ending, boy.
Mm. Okay. this hey that was a good one that was a good one right there y'all I promise you man Tubers don't down me. Okay, trombone. Good job, yeah.
okay? They're real big. Don't speed it up. Don't don't speed it up. I know y'all hype. Nice. Get tired on me. Well, your mom's got that nice wall of sound. It, it's really good. Come on. First, don't do that. it right there all right y'all so that was carver going against car so just watching carver high school so first of all let's give it up to both of these high school bands because both of them sound like phenomenal they, they have a great tonality now both have their issues of course carver we're looking at your your tuba players and look um to building up that tonality and all that other stuff. Of course, you know, the basics, long tones, all this other stuff. But uh, another thing is do what uh, you would do your instrument players. If you had them sitting in the truck leaning back, make the tubas do the same thing. It helps out. It's going to help the breathing plus rounding out the sound. And then also have them to play facing a wall. When you do that, they have their tubas to be able to hear their own sound, hear how they sound. But when they're facing a the wall and they're playing, they can hear this. So sometimes when they go into sectionals, have them to turn to, toward the wall and then play in sectionals so they can hear that sound. That sound bouncing back is going to intentionally make them want to, of course, develop a rounder tone because they, now they hear it. So those are a couple of pointers they can use. Uh... Now, in the car, yo, the mellows are bananas. They killing the game. It sounding good. Uh, at times, of course, car tuba players were, you know, lacking for, I guess, certain parts. Build up your stamina. If you're going to play like that during the battle, play like that during practice, and then also during sectionals, once you've gotten the music down pat and you're completely done with sectionals, then what you do is you... Still in sectionals, you turn it up as if you're in a battle. That's what you sh uh, should do. That builds stamina. And then, of course, going back into practice, you turn it up. Again. So, usually, during practice, you play. When you get tired, you keep pushing. That's just build stamina. That's all it is. But both bands did amazing. Y'all sound great. But you all know there's got to be one victor. So, everybody, what I want you to do is come on up, hop on in the comment section, and let your boy know who y'all think won. Did you think George Washington Carver won, or did you think Edna Carr won? Come on and go crazy in the comment section and let your boy know. And with that being said, look, make sure y'all like, y'all comment, y'all subscribe. Make sure you hit that bell so you know when your boys upload. And become a part of the family. Yes, sir. And with that being said, y'all, look, peace, love. A whole lot of hair grease. Keep banding your life. And we out.